Hello, I'm Juliette Williams from the um, tourist office. I'm the tourism manager in St. Helena. Hey, well, good morning and thank you very much for talking to Breaking Travel News today. We're here in Berlin for ITB Berlin uh, 2019. Uh, how important is it for St. Helena to be here to connect with your partners from the travel industry? So um, St. Helena first made its presence at ITB um, last year. Um, we attended and we were um, on the Atta stand, which was in the African Hall. Um, so as you know, St. Helena has a connection with um, France the Napoleonic attraction. So um, this is, um, ITB is very important to us to be able to reach out to our European market. It's a very exciting time for the destination. You've doubled the number of flights that's going to be available next year. What will that do for the tourism sector on the island? So um, as you know, um, we only had a um, flight, our flights only start in October 2017. Um, between our summer months, which is December to April, we introduced a midweek flight on a Tuesday. So we normally have a, a weekly flight on a Saturday but we have a midweek flight on a Tuesday during our summer months and also we're introducing it again for this year so within December this year to April next year we can confirm that we'll have midweek flights again. Um, we've noticed um, since we've had our airport we've had an increase in our tourist numbers and also an interest in St Helena because it's now accessible by air. What do guests do when they arrive on the island? Uh, I know Mantis have a property down there so it's quite a luxurious destination or are you open to a number of sectors? So um, we're a unique destination really, so um, we arrange, um, so like you said, we have a four-star Mantis Hotel, um, so that is our top um, hotel which has 30 bedrooms and then it ranges down to um, some smaller hotels and little B&B guest houses, so it's like homestays, so you know, visitors get the feel of actually staying with us local. Well, it sounds like a great destination, hopefully we'll come down there, thank you very much. Thank you. Um, so also, um, like you said, what St. Helena has to offer the visitors. So, you know, we're an adventure destination. So we're not your idyllic um, beach destination. So you don't come to St. Helena to lay, um, to lay on the beach because um, we're a volcanic black sandy um, beaches, or volcanic island. So you would come for our walking and hiking. So, you know, we, we've been told that we got um, our walking and hiking is up there with a lot of the top countries. Also, um, our dive in a marine is really spectacular. So we have seasons, so we have a whale shark season, which is very popular with the visitors. So that is between the months of January and March. So obviously having the midweek flight during that period helps more visitors to be able to visit during that time. Our diving is spectacular as well. Um, you know, with our, with our marine life, you don't have to travel hours in our boat. Um, obviously being an island and surrounded by the ocean, you only have to travel like, you know, 15 minutes to half an hour and you can be there, you know, snorkeling and swimming with the whale sharks or diving in our wrecks and seeing our marine life as well. Sounds great. Thank you very much. Thank you.